Hello there, today I'm going to show you your Python-based Discord bots console look nice when a command is run, or just in general. Uh, this just makes it a little nicer to look at and quite a lot easier to understand what's going on while your bot is running. So, let's look at w what happens when my bot is ready. So, first it changes the presence, so what, the, what it's playing, to Salt and Carthage. Then, it prints a bunch of dashes, hyphens, hyphens is the correct term here, prints a bunch of hyphens, and then it grabs the current time using date time. I have it imported as dt, just because I don't like date time dot date time dot now. dt dot date time dot now is a lot easier to type and less stupid. So it does that and then it used to remove the command help here but I found that that wasn't necessary and it's better to just put it here so I commented that out I might remove that at some point I don't know then I have it print the current time from this variable that defined what time it was and then I just print downloading and print more dashes then when we go down to the next command, I print a space, and I don't do that up here because that's the first thing that's being run. But then, so first it grabs the time that the command was initiated, prints a space, and then says working, then dash it, or hyphens, prints current time, test has been run. So if we pop this open, this is just going to be better than the terminal on Visual Studio Code. We can see that it is downloading. Now if we pop into Discord, and type like test for example it'll say test has been run give me the time um, and yeah the, t the time does actually update this is 25 that's an 18 I did actually mess that up at one point <laughs> um, you know Carthago Delanda S rants in really bad Latin that I got from Google Translate uh, oh Wait, did I not add that? I, I can't. I have to be careful not to show you my. That should do that. Maybe it's just because I clicked on it. Who knows? Eh, there it goes. So it says it says that you could add more hyphens, but I like it being quite uniform. And that space adds just a little space in between them, make it look a little nicer. I guess you don't need these ones. But I don't know. It looks nice. And yeah. So all you have to do to get date time is download it using pip uh, it's pip install date time um, yeah it's quite simple and it really makes your bot a lot nicer looking in the console um, and it lets you know what's going on for example I'm sure there's a way to disable this sort of or to fix this from happening but if I type like ping Rhythm will respond, because that's a command, but this will complain that ping is not found, so, you know, you could probably disable ping somehow, or this from outputting this error, but, you know, it's quite nice to have what's happening, errors, when your commands are being run, so, yeah, it's quite nice, and uh, thank you for watching. Goodbye!